No, 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 no. What? We're about to film this video, but I don't want to show my garage. Guys, right here we have four, yes, four 10 foot kayaks that are either pedal drive driven kayaks or pro drive driven kayaks. I'm gonna go over each of them, tell you what I think about them, and let you know which one is better for you. Let's go. This right here is definitely a kayak. It's a 10 foot and a half. It's powered by a human powered motor, and it, it even has um, dinghy wheels. Nice kayak. This video is made possible by the best Amp Outdoors lithium batteries. Simply the best battery you could buy with your money. Why? Because they have real warranty and Amp Outdoors have a crazy lines of batteries that go anywhere from powering your fish finder, your trolling motor, even your life. You could use an inverter and I don't know, cook with those batteries. This one right here is a 36 volt battery, waterproof. You could like dunk this on the water and it will be fine. I mean, just don't leave it there. Read the, read the regulations. But anyways, you want to get a really high quality lithium battery and from a company that's going to actually honor the warranty on top doors. Right, Lucas? <laughs> we got a 10 foot kayak made in Thailand, 10 foot kayak made in China, another 10 foot kayak made in China, and a 10 foot kayak made in the US. Okay. But guys, probably the item you're using to watch this video wasn't even made in the US. So I don't think that's a determining factor. But if you are really into a US made kayak, super quality kayak, look no further than this one, the 106 PDL by Old Town, made in Old Town, Maine by really good people. The Vibe is also made by really good people. And the Riot is the same company as Buy and feel free is an amazing company and they really take care of you so um no complaints about them now let's talk about this kayaks and which one will you get so this little kayak right here is a 10 foot moken feel free 10 pdl kayak it has a built-in wheel like few kayaks have that that's epic some epic stuff and it comes with that drive that drive goes in reverse and it goes forward and it's really fast for this boat. This boat is also very stable. For example, if you compare here with the Riot, you have sort of the same drive, pro drive. This drive is more, it feels like more like it belongs there. This one happens to work there. <laughs> I don't know how, but it works because the mechanism is not the best, but it does work. But I would say something, this drive is very light and it's durable. This one is a little heavier, clunkier, and both of them make a weird sound so sound is not gonna make a difference but also the difference here in price is that the riot maker is cheaper it looks nice too and one of the advantages that it has is that the rotor control you can move it to your left or your right depending uh, who you are and I think that will be your left and that will be your right sorry I'm behind the camera um, this I love open deck designs like this I love the tank well like that over there and it looks like you could even put rods on on top of the uh, the kayak like you have space for that here you don't have that because you sort of have like a wall here see that there and you do have a hash here in the back it's really nice to access inside the boat here you don't have that I don't see a hash anymore oh yeah <laughs> dude <laughs> there's a hatch right there at the end which is really nice too because you could work things out here in the rear like fix the rotor cables and things like that and let me see yeah i don't think there's any other hatch but i do like the open sort of open deck design here i have the drive there now it's being held there it was molded in to hold the drive but it's, it, it would be better if the drive could just go and stay there like this one right now let's move on here uh, sister company by kayaks and riot they're working where this macana could take this drive and then you get instant reverse I hope that they do a better mechanism that would take the drive that instead of having this crazy stuff here with all those clunkiness the drive would just pop up because this drive could go up and down like that shaft could go up and down so they should totally make a mechanism that will work like that here now the mechanic comes with the X drive and uh, I have it over there 
but I highly recommend you get a hobby drive like the 180 drive like that I have here and something great about the Macana is those pods they're interchangeable like you could remove that pod and put a flat deck pod or coming soon you're gonna be able to use this drive to go instant reverse and from what I hear it works amazingly here that it's very fast and all that stuff and I really don't see why you shouldn't be able to take both of them just take an extra pod you got a lot of space right here in the back to uh, you know put the drive and the pod and all the stuff and that one is not as heavy at all this one is not heavy either so they both have that open deck design if you open this here and you do have a giant hatch there but those hatches are more forgiving when it comes to taking water than like an oversized hatch you have on the hobies and things like that i really enjoy my time on the macana if, if you have me shoes i'll definitely buy the macana over the riot uh, between these two I uh, well I mean I'll probably lean toward mechanic because it has more stuff but it's also more money now let's talk about the 106 PDL <laughs> the 106 PDL by Old Town this kayak is a proven 10 foot kayak it's been in the market for a long time I did a full in-depth comparison between these two boats you can check it out I'm gonna link it somewhere around here but if you don't see it just search uh, Macana versus 106 PDL and it will show up Again, made in the U.S., five-year warranty, proven drive, the drive floats, epic boat. Why would you get a fin drive over a pro drive? Well, the fin drive is about eight pounds. Also, if you train yourself, you're going to be able to use it in shallower water, although to me it's best just to paddle, but hey, you don't have to remove the drive. You could just feather it and you keep going. That's, and oh, storage, like storing this big drive is a headache. Putting that drive inside the... The car is a headache because it's big and bulky and heavy. Those hobby drive, those thin drive are easier to store and use off the water. So just want to know, what do you guys think? Which one will you get? Comment below. Let me know. Now, another thing that I want to say, 10 foot kayaks tend to be less expensive because it's less materials. It's less everything. So it's going to cost less. And I also find that for most applications, unless you're fishing big waters or you're going really far away, uh, a 10 foot kayak is plenty of boat for you. You could definitely get something like this, put a nice cooler in the back, just look at that giant tan well, put your launch cooler here, and you have plenty of space to go do your fishing. Everything is close to you. If you need to reach on the back to get anything, you could do it from the seat. Put right there. When you have a bigger boat, it's like, it's like you want to reach but you can't because it's too far away so inches count when it comes to kayaking and a lot of these boats are really efficient are really fast this is very fast this one is actually better than the 12 footer sea stream it's faster it's lighter I, I like it better 10 foot kayak when you had to lift it up when you had to put it back on your garage when you had to put it on top of your car are far better than having a bigger kayak but if you're a big guy if you fish a lot of big waters you're definitely gonna have to go for the big kayaks like we have here and i did a comparison video of all these kayaks i went through all of them but in this video i just wanted to focus on the 10 footers i do have more 10 foot kayaks here i just don't have the space to line them up but let me know what you think in the comments which kayak will you buy and why and if if it's not here just comment below it doesn't matter